to clean the clippers is just simple so first you have the clippers then you get the lubricating oil for the cleansing purposes as well as the clipper brush if you lost this brush uh, you can just get a an old or an old toothbrush now to clean the blades first zoom it up first of all you must use the brush to flush up or to remove all the hairs that stopped on the blade so like that if you are sure now that it was already been removed you you can now remove the clipper blade out of the clipper body so this is the clipper body and this is these are the clipper blades so now I'm gonna show you just hold down the clipper blade like this and hold the bottom part of the clipper like that then you just use your thumb to push it downwards like that now it's pop up like that now you can see the the mechanics or the parts inside the clipper body uh, you can see that rotor inside which rotates in a circular which rotates in circular motion that transfers the mechanical processes through the clipper blades in order for it to move sidewards like that it moves this, words, this moves sidewards like that in a fast motion so now you can see this part this is the clipper blade part so most often hair stocks in this part inside that part so all you got all you have to do is to lubricate the brush or directly put the oil slowly or gently in the blades only for the blades you can just use the brush to spread out the oil, lubricating oil so now I'm gonna put some oil in the brush just a little bit slowly but surely now just wipe it off like that first the blades then move it sidewards a little bit like that in order for you to scrape all those hairs at the sides now on the other side like that so to check if it's already been cleaned or all the hairs are out of the clipper blades you can just simply use uh, a kind of a stick or something that can pull this up a bit just a bit I'm gonna use the cleaning brush because it's a slender and it can uh, go inside the blade upper blades so like that you can see I put it on the slot like that so the upper blades and the lower blades are now separated so as you can see there are small bits of hair left inside so we're gonna clean that just hold or support it with your finger to make it open and slowly brush it off and check if there are left here inside so now it's clean we are done now with the clipper blades so now we are going to clean the clipper body this is the housing part of the blade so the rotor must be cleaned uh, with the use of brush and not that too much application of oil because once the oil run off inside this part it is uh, the thing might happen is that it might have burned up the motor inside the clipper so it will not uh, 
it will not op you cannot operate it anymore so now you can see there are tiny bits of hair inside I've already used it so you can uh, see how to clean it properly so what we're going to do is just brush it off like that to remove all those hair okay now that's nice and clean and now I'm gonna show you how to turn the clipper blades back so to retain the clip to return the clipper bla bla blades back into the housing so I'm gonna show it like that this part has a slot under it. that one this part that is the slot wherein you're going to put this part this and both parts so what we're gonna do is to put it first into the slot like this one put it into the slot yeah. once it's, it is aligned you can now just press the clipper down and slide like that one and pop yeah. once you hear that clicking sound it's now already been attached and that one so hope you would like it and hope you enjoy watching this video tutorial how to clean and how to operate the Bowley dog hair clipper thank you don't forget to subscribe